As for the Broncos, I, I, I mean, what in the world Ooh. has happened to Russell Wilson? I, I mean, seriously, Steve, Steve, you must be hearing everything too. Yeah. What What in the world has happened to Russell it, Wilson? It, and, and Rich, think about when we were watching him with Seattle. We just had Matt Mayoko on uh, from the NBC Bay Area, and he was talking about watching how Russell Wilson used to destroy the 49ers back in the day. Yeah. Just think yeah. about how he would line up, you know, in shotgun, take five-step drops. He's 20 yards behind the line of scrimmage running around, throwing the ball 40 yards downfield to Doug Baldwin. He just looked automatic every time. It didn't matter what yeah. his offensive line was, and he looked great. And now he's throwing the ball from like six yards behind the line of scrimmage, getting it batted down like there's 10 J.J. Watts in front of him. He does not look confident whatsoever, and clearly Sean Payton is about at his wit's end with him. Yeah, he used to wear people out. Yes. Remember, he would used to wear people out, just roll, and it's just like, oh, he's rolling out again? Really? He's going to, you know, you couldn't get him down. Like, he would extend plays and extend plays and extend plays and look down the field and just wear you out with his legs and with his arm, and now he just looks worn out, period. I, I cannot believe what has happened. He was on the track and the path to the Pro Football Hall of Fame. There's no question about that, and right now, you have to wonder if, you know, uh, out goes Randy Gregory, out goes Frank Clark. If, you know, if they're just pruning the tree a little bit here to keep on pruning the tree a little bit here. And, you know, Sean Payton's not getting one and done like like Nathaniel Hackett. No. So all you got to do is just keep on keep on like this and talk about how, as Sean Payton said after the game, he's disappointed but not discouraged because they tried hard. And that that just sounds to me – um, unlike he's just trying to keep a, a brave face on right now. He knows what's going on. I imagine with his team and what everything else is going on, um, potentially, uh, down the road as well. Yeah. And I mean, why in the hell wouldn't he want what I'm sure Belichick maybe in heart of hearts is thinking about any other coach that knows that they've got a trophy or trophies in the case and certain amount of road in front of them that um that 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 remains for their legacies for their own hall of fame resumes caleb williams sitting out there i mean let's not kid each other this kid is so damn good and so amazing how do you not sit here and think about that right now well i'm sure they think, i'm sure they're thinking about it rich i mean the the broncos can actually get out from under russell wilson um there is there will be some cap cost if they do that but after the season they can get out Please. from under him and, and, Why wouldn't and, they? and, and i and i think that's happening and, you know, and I think there's going to be significant change with that staff next year and, and this roster. It is just amazing. I, I Again, I'm a big Russell Wilson fan. And just Me too. watching him last night, Rich, and I know he had played some decent games before then, but it still didn't look, uh, you know, it is, is like you were saying, it's like he is a shell of himself. And I can't imagine with quarterbacks playing into their 40s now that him at his age, what is he now, about 34, 35, that he looks – because you know he's trying hard. It, it it is not like he's just out there going through the motions, but he just looks so unsure of Russell Wilson. When just a couple of years ago, we we're seeing him all over, you know, with him and Sierra everywhere, where he was the most confident yeah. guy in the world. Well, I mean, listen, um, he's just not the same anymore, and it's not like they don't have any weapons. Catch the Rich Eisen show every single day on the Roku channel, twelve to three Eastern, for free. 